Dozens of people have lost their lives and properties along the Kenya-Ethiopian border due to communal conflicts. It is these conflicts that the visiting Degodia king from Ethiopia, Wabar Abdi Wabar, says have done great harm to the development of the region. You can't preach regional integrations from your capitals. Politicians, we the politicians, they you have to use, we have to use the spiritual leaders, the religious leaders, the elders of our people such as Wabar Abdi Ilen, Wabar Abdi. Wabar, who is on a maiden trip to Kenya, says time has come for communities along the border to realize that peace is the only way they will compete with the rest of the world. Wabar challenged residents to see beyond the conflict and realize the world is moving forward. Northern Kenya leaders led by Wajia Governor Mohamed Abdi and National Assembly Majority Leader Adan Duale urged residents of Northern Kenya to unite and speak with one voice for the sake of development. We would like the Wabar and his uh, committee, the Council of Elders who are with him, to preach peace and unity among the communities that are living in Kenya, particularly the communities that are in northern Kenya who are always fighting over water and pasture. And on behalf of the people of Kenya and President Uhuru Kenyatta, we are always committed as a country to make sure that the region is very stable. That communities that live across the border between Kenya and Somalia, Somalia and Ethiopia, Ethiopia and Kenya, Ethiopia and Somalia, live peacefully because they all belong to the same communities. Wabar will be touring a number of counties in northern Kenya on a peace mission.